It really was. And Alicia, you mentioned before, this was like a rock star coming. It felt like President Obama was here or the royal family was coming to Ann Arbor. I mean, this was a national spotlight. You had hundreds of media members all focused on one man, one job. When you looked around the room and you saw the family members, the former coaches, former players embracing Coach Harbaugh, you realize very quickly that there's a sentimental element that transcends anything said on the podium. By now, you've seen Jim Harbaugh make his way to the podium and address the Maize and Blue faithful. But to truly understand the gravity of this homecoming, turn your gaze now to the countless cameras, the jostling of journalists, the Mount Rushmore of Michigan football, all in attendance. This was no ordinary introduction. This was a coronation. To have a guy who means this much to this program come back from uh, the NFL is it's a wonderful thing. We wanted a guy who, who was a Michigan man, who, who's been here, who knows, the, who knows the program, knows what Michigan's all about. He's been a leader of teams, right? So I know what it's like when he's on the sideline, and I'm very nervous. Can you blame Jackie Harbaugh? Her son's got some huge expectations to meet, but greeting the Harbaugh's today are the people who remember Jim Harbaugh long before his Wolverine days under center. His father, Jack Harbaugh, believes that may have been what ultimately brought his son back to the big house. Sitting in Bo's chair, I am sneaking into the I, build, I am building to play pickup basketball with some of the students when he was a, a freshman and sophomore at, uh, at Pioneer High School. Those were moments in his life that kids have that they, they remember forever. And I think those experiences is, is kind of what brought him to this place and, and being here in Ann Arbor and being the football coach. You have to enjoy the moment you're in and you have to do the very best with what you have, where you are at any given time. And that's how I frame everything. You know, these things don't happen every day. Absolutely, Coach Carr. You know, Coach Harbaugh talked a lot about his childhood. You know, back then, uh, Jack Harbaugh uh, was a coach, of course, for Michigan, and he talked a lot about just growing up here. So there was definitely that sentimental value, and you looked around the room and family members were nodding. It felt like a family reunion with about 100 cameras in the room, of course, but uh, not a bad first day for the coach, guys. <laughs>